Welcome to CES 2016, biggest event ever. The semifinalists, as you know, are competing for a chance to pitch Sir Richard Branson himself. Welcome everybody to the Extreme Tech Challenge semifinals. This is our second year, so we're still kind of a young uh, contest, but boy, do we have great companies. The challenge that these young entrepreneurs have is being relentless with selling their dream to other people. So a big thank you to all of the judges taking those more than 1,000 applicants from around the world and just whittling them all the way down to the 10 that you are going to see on this stage today. SmartPlate comes with embedded cameras and weight sensors that identify and weigh everything sitting on its surface. First, the camera is out already. You can use it anywhere and it's even waterproof. The stream cuts the beam to control the screen. This is the most revolutionary way to fund a growing business. At no time in human history could someone for basically an internet connection and an idea come up with a great idea that could have global implications and create a global business almost overnight. It requires capital, requires engineering, requires marketing, uh, uh, and requires a little luck. We want an international giant robot combat league. It's the only type of cancer treatments that is potentially a cure. Hopefully becoming one of the first technology companies focused on the cannabis space to be traded on a major US exchange. Having something called an extreme tech challenge kind of attracts the kind of entrepreneur that I'm looking for. The passion of the CEO or founder of the company, that's really important. We combine wearable devices with data analytics to reassure moms and provide doctors with better information our platform connects seamlessly to all at Mountain Play. We want to bring the world of physical play and your digital life together. The first company to go to Necker with us is Gyroptic. Congratulations. It's Bloom Technologies. And to complete the trio going to Necker, Sphero Technologies. Richard has a really special message for you guys. A big congratulations to the top three. Actually, since I'm impressed with all of you in the top ten, I hope you will attend the finals here on Necker Island as well. Because everybody of the top ten gets to go anyways, I don't really think that there was a winner or a loser here today. If I were Richard, I'd want to probably meet at the top 25, <laughs> you know, if I had the time. <laughs> 